In this homework, we will explore the Feigenbaum number, also known as the Feigenbaum constant. This universal constant applies to all one-dimensional, one-parameter maps with a single quadratic maximum. This constant describes the limiting ratio of each bifurcation interval to the next between every period doubling, as described by this formula. In the following four problems, we will make a first estimate of the Feigenbaum constant. That is, we will calculate this equation. To do this, we will need to calculate B1, B2, and B3, where B1, for example, is the R value where the dynamics bifurcate from a fixed point to a two cycle. Similarly, B2 is the R value where the dynamics bifurcate from a two cycle to a four cycle, and so on. We have seen several times now, both in homeworks and quizzes, that the bifurcation from fixed point dynamics to two cycles occurs at r equals 3. So b1 is equal to 3. This is the answer to 1a. To obtain b2, we need to use the bifurcation tool you generated in homework 2.2 to zoom into this region. If we do that, see that the bifurcation from two cycle dynamics to four cycle dynamics occurs at 3.44948. This is the answer to 1b. Similarly, to obtain B3, we need to zoom into this area, which is the area where it seems a 4 cycle to an 8 cycle occurs. If we do this with our bifurcation tool, we see that the bifurcation from a 4 cycle to an 8 cycle occurs at 3.54409. And this gives us the answer to 1C. We can now combine B1, B2, and B3 to create a first approximation of the Feigenbaum constant. We get a first approximation of 4.7514. This is the answer to question 1E.